हेलो फ्रॉम माइंड पैट्स टीओ के एस ए नवम्बर ट्वेंटी सेवेंटीन टॉपिक नंबर थ्री ओवर टाइम नॉलेज इज बिकम मोर एक्यूरेट डिस्कस द स्टेटमेंट विद रेफरेंस टू टू एरियाज ऑफ नॉलेज नॉलेज क्वेश्चन वन वॉट इज द सिग्निफिकेंस ऑफ एक्यूरेसी इन नॉलेज नॉलेज इज कंसिडर्ड एक्यूरेट इफ द नोन द मेजर और द प्रिडिक्टेड और सेम और इक्वल टू द ट्रूथ द रियल द एक्चुअल एंड द एग्जिस्टिंग any deviation or discrepancy will be an error when confronted with errors it is a natural response to investigate probe inquire reflect and reexamine what went wrong compared to this the zero anomaly from accuracy not only bolsters existing strategy and practices it reinforces credence to prevailing knowledge and information the accurate knowledge not only requires ways to get close to the truth to be error free but also knowing what is true real actual and existing for example through sense perception we can observe and know both the measured and practiced with the actual and real in natural sciences to have accurate knowledge may not be easy in areas of knowing like religious systems and ethics where the truth or the real and the actual is subjective to the individual community and society For additional content, read more at mindpads.org. Knowledge question two: What are the essential elements that bring about accurate knowledge over time? The accuracy of knowledge is vastly dependent on the accuracy of the instruments, technology of the time, and the data available to the existing or prevailing theories. Over time, possession of abundant and accessible data, combined with the technology of computing and algorithms and analysis, provides opportunities to acquire and produce knowledge that is both accurate and objective. The theories in natural sciences call for a general consensus among the scientific community after the observations, experiments, investigations, and results are found to be consistent, reproducible, and in agreement over time. the claims and counter claims stand to persevere from scrutiny and explanation and the resulting outcome is based on a well balanced and robust foundation this examination through claims and conflicting claims entails deeper recognition and judgment instead of mere accommodation taking for instance theory building or theory change in natural and human sciences involve a community process of sharing experiments observations feedback in interpreting the data in distinct ways and in varied settings the process entails rigor and prolonged deliberation that has the higher objective to seek accurate knowledge for entire humanity knowledge question 3 how has improved data and better technology affected the accuracy and knowledge over time the availability of vast data has improved our understanding and predictions of natural and human sciences by being instrumental in formulating a plan strategy and decision making for example any sample model the standard error is equal to the standard deviation by square root n the more data points or n suggests a lower standard error for the design model with a large number of data points the underlying distribution of that data set is clearer to classify by default we get a truly representative sample space a theory even if a very good and elegant one will suffer from confirmation bias while facts and evidence from experiments and reality enable not just to test and verify theories but modify alter upgrade and choose from competing theories Very often theories are constructed by systematically collecting data and carefully analyzing the data for patterns and even when facts do not play a dominant role in giving birth to a theory facts play a crucial role in shaping the theory's development if deductions from a theory are incorrect the theory will be changed or abandoned knowledge question 4 How have various ways of knowing contributed towards accurate knowledge over time? In the pursuit of accuracy, we consciously look into errors. These insights and learnings from error hold deeper roots in our memory. 
We remember the failed experiments, the bad ideas, the costly mistakes, the misinterpretations and all the wrong assumptions made. We are held back in all aspects by the fear of committing error. Recognizing and dealing with error constitutes a foundational principle of scientific inquiry. Both intentional and unintentional confrontations with error are central to our pursuits of understanding and knowing. We have used language to bring in standardization and clarity to conceptualize, define and express knowledge. The scientific terms, definitions and accompanying illustrations have evolved to be increasingly precise and accurate. In the last two centuries, natural sciences and human sciences have made continuous and persistent efforts through sense perception and reason to make sense of the recognized patterns leading us to form associations and shape our understandings of almost every aspect of our lives. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. For additional content, visit us at mindpads.org and for any queries, write to us at mindpads.org at gmail.com.